A very good morning, children. Welcome back to the session. So today we will continue the remaining part of the lesson. Touch typing part two. In the previous video classes, you have learned about touch typing. The benefits of touch typing, isn't it, children? So touch typing is the ability to type fast without having to look at the keyboard. So now tell me what are the benefits, children? So it increases the typing speed and also it reduces the errors, isn't it, children? So not only that, you have also learned the names of the fingers. Thumb finger, index finger, middle finger, ring finger, little finger, or even, even you can call it as pinky finger. Okay, children. And you have learned the home keys, isn't it, children? So you have learned the home keys. What are the home keys, children? Yes. These are the home keys. So you have learned the home keys and the placement of your fingers and the home keys in the previous video class, isn't it, children? So you can see, children, the home key A on the... So if you want to... What is the placement, children? So for letter A, the pinky, you have to use left pinky finger. For S, left ring finger. For D, left middle finger. And for F, you have to use pointer, left pointer finger. Coming to the right side, for semicolon, you have to use the right pinky finger. For L, you have to use the right ring finger. For K, you have to use right middle finger. And for J, you have to use right pointer finger. So you have learned all these things, isn't it? So always remember that the home keys are very important. If you wish to learn touch typing, okay, children. So therefore, as soon as you move a finger from the home key, make it a point to bring the finger back onto the home key immediately after typing the letter. So immediately, you have to bring your finger back on the home key. Understood, children. So now, so if you observe the home keys, each of the home keys have both a key above them and a key below them. Isn't it, children? So, for example, let us take example. The home key A. So, it has a key Q on the top of it and a key Z below it. Isn't it, children? You can see on the top of the A, you can see Q and below you can see Z. So, if you need to type quickly, you, you would use your left little finger to type Q, A and Z. So, you have to use left pinky or little finger to type Q, A and Z. So similarly, uh, if you see S, above you can see W and below you can see the key X. So you have to use right, left, right, left ring finger to type W, S and X. Okay, children. So the next one is D. Above you can see E and below you can see C. So you have to use left middle finger to type E, D, C. Similarly, if you want to type F, if you take the key F, above you can see R and below you can see V. So you have to use your left pointer finger to type R, F and V. Okay, children. So coming similarly, it's the same thing, the right hand side also. So if you, the semicolon, if you take, above you can see P and below slash. So you have to use right pinky finger to type P, semicolon, slash. Similarly, L, if you take L, Above you can see O and below full stop. So you have to use right ring finger to type O, L and full stop. So in the same way you have to type, use your fingers. Okay, children. So if you want to type U, J and M, you have to use the right pointer finger. Okay. So now, so you all uh, know how to type uh, the home keys ASDF and semicolon LKG. And also, you know the fingers to be used to type this. So now, to type the keys, Y, H, G, T, N, and B, we use the pointer finger that is closest to the key. Okay, children. So you have to use your pointer finger. For example, uh, so left pointer finger, you, you have to use to type G. And right pointer finger, you have to use to type H. Okay, children. 
Similarly, so we would use the right pointer finger to press Y, H and N and the left pointer finger to press Y, sorry, T, G and B keys. Okay, children? So the pointer fingers will be used quite a lot as compared to other fingers. Understood, children? So, so now, next. Typing numbers using the test tag. So how to type numbers using test tag? So here is a picture, children. So these are the fingers to be used to type numbers. Okay, children. So now let us see in detail. Okay. So now this is uh, your left hand. So for left hand uh, keys, you have to the left index finger is used to type the key four and to type three use left middle finger children and the two key is typed with your left ring finger and if you want to type one you have to use the little pinky finger understood children so left pinky finger for one uh, left ring finger for two and uh, left middle finger for three and pointer finger to type four or index finger. Okay, children. So now let us see the right hand side keys. To type the seven key, one should use the right index finger. So you have to use the right index finger to type seven and uh, to type the number eight, we have to use right middle finger to type 9, we have to use the right ring finger. And to type 0, you have to use pinky or little finger. Understood, children? So you have to use 7. You have to use pointer or index finger to type 7. Middle finger to type 8. Right ring finger to type 9. And right pinky finger to type 0. Okay, children? So now... Both 5 and 6 keys are typed with the index fingers. So you can see children, they are very close. So that's why you have to use your left pointer finger to type 5 and you have to use the right pointer finger to type 6. So both 5 and 6 keys are typed with the index fingers as it is very easier to reach these keys using index fingers. Okay, so you have to... Now, based on this, answer the following questions, children. So, what is touch typing? So touch typing is the ability to type fast without having to look at the keyboard. Okay, children. Now, the second question. What are the benefits of touch typing, children? Touch typing can increase the typing speed and it reduces errors. So, that's all for today, children. Here is a small assignment for you all. Write the name of the fingers that are used to type the following numbers. So these are the numbers. You have to write the name of the fingers. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. So thank you and have a nice day.